Over here in Germany, you can get this watch for just about 30 euros, which is super cheap. You can either get this matte silver version or you can get the color midnight black, but as for the price, both will cost the same. Now, honestly, this watch feels huge. I have a 19 centimeter wrist, which is not small, and this 49 millimeter smartwatch just looks massive on it. It's a 49 by 40 by 11.4 millimeter smartwatch, which weighs in at 30 gram, and you have a super large two inch LCD display, which lights up with a peak brightness of 500 nits. Just to put this into perspective, the Apple Watch 10 lights up with a peak brightness of 2000 nits. Now something else I noticed is that you get some huge black bezels, which are a bit slimmer on the side, but you get a big fat lip on the bottom of the screen, which really doesn't look too good in my opinion. Now on the side of the plastic case you will get one physical button that will either take you to your app menu or it will open up your Alexa voice assistant. But you can also trigger the SOS feature by quickly triple tapping this button. The Redmi Watch 5 Active has a 22mm TPU strap that comes in the same color as the case plus it has a quick release feature. So these straps are quite flexible and feel super rubbery and as well as you need to know that this watch is compatible with both Android and iOS smartphones and on both you will get the same features. As for the battery life, this watch has a 470 mAh battery which lasts up to 18 days on normal usage which is very long but again pretty normal for a budget smartwatch in this price category. You don't have many features on here, no AMOLED display and no always on display mode which lowers the power consumption a lot. On heavy usage the Redmi Watch 5 Active still lasts about 12 days and that's with all of your health trackers enabled with the lowest tracking intervals, some Bluetooth calling and 2 hours of workouts per week. Just don't expect to get a quick charging on this watch. By the way, if you like my content, feel free to leave a like and subscribe to my channel. And you will also find all of the links to the products down below in the description. All right, so what smart features can you expect to get on this watch? And first up, the Alexa voice assistant. I did have some starting issues, but after logging back into my Amazon account, it finally started working. And with this one, you can set timers, you can ask for the weather, you can use the stopwatch, and you can also control all of your smart lights at home if they are connected to Alexa. Then you will also get a phone feature, and I guess you can say that this one will get the job done. You can decline and receive calls on this watch, or you can start calls from it by either punching in the number on a dial pad, or you can add Add some context to this watch and then start calls like this. You have a weather app with a forecast for the next four days plus it tells you when it's sunrise and sunset and even the humidity. You have a stopwatch, there's a timer, an alarm, you have a find my phone feature but the phone won't ring if your phone is muted. This watch also has a music player which only controls the music on your smartphone and you can skip a track, go back and you can also adjust the volume. You have a focus timer which I would definitely use if I would use the smartwatch every day and you can control your smartphone's camera by using your smartwatch. Now I also mentioned you have an SOS emergency feature. For this open up the Mi Fitness app and first you need to add an emergency contact with name and the number and now if you triple press the side button it will call this person for help. You get over 200 watch faces that you can download from the watch face store including some funny designs, basic analog and digital watch faces and you can also use pictures from your gallery. Some of your watch faces are also packed with metrics and you can customize some as well. Like you can change the style and the color of the time and you can also change the displayed apps and then interact with those from your home display. Something else that you can also customize are your tiles. As you can see you get multiple apps per tile and each of these apps can be swapped out for another one. You can either do it right on the watch or you can do it on your smartphone. And basically all you need to do is to click on one of the apps and change it with any app that you have on your smartwatch. You can either just have one app per tile but also up to four. You just need to change the layout in order to do so. Next we have the health tracking. This watch has an all day heart rate tracker that will either track every minute but you can also to set it to only track every 10 or 30 minutes. Then you will also get some heart rate alerts as well. You have an SPO2 and a stress tracker that both track 24 seven and judging by the stress tracker, I'm always super relaxed. You have the vitality score, breathing exercises and a sleep tracker. It does seem to work pretty good, at least when it comes to the sleep duration at the time that I woke up and fell asleep. It tracks your sleeping cycles, your average heart rate and SPO2 level over the night. You will get a breathing score and you also have an analysis. So actually quite a lot for a 30 euro smartwatch. As well as we have the fitness tracking and the first thing that you need to know is that this watch doesn't have a built-in GPS. But there are over 140 different sport modes. Of course there is something like walking, running and cycling but if you click on more you will get to your sport brackets and right here you will find things like dancing workouts, hit and yoga, ball and winter sports, card games and 
somatosensory, whatever that's supposed to be. There are also only little customization options for your workouts. You can set goals and alerts and you have an auto pause function, but that's it. At least you have an auto workout detection, which will automatically start your workouts like walking, running, cycling, rowing, you got jump roping and elliptical. And guys, there we have it. That's the Xiaomi Redmi Watch 5 Active. Now, if you liked that video, make sure to leave a like and subscribe to my channel for more tech reviews. And I guess with that one being said, I will see you in the next one. Peace.